is up you guys this is mini superheroes today hey guys jonathan here aka mini superheroes today and i've got tons of fan mail to open up with you guys here on camera this fan mail came in over the last month or so uh celebrating the seven year anniversary of my channel here on mini superheroes today so stick around till the end i do have something that everybody that sent me fan mail here is going to receive so with that being said let's get into opening the mail Real quick, in the description of this video, I've got a link to my No Way Home song, which has a stop motion music video to go with it. I think you guys are really gonna dig it, so check that out and let me know what you think. Okay, so I have kind of cut some of these open just for the sake of, you know, getting them open, but I haven't actually opened anything in them. Um, so here's number one. We've got something wrapped here, which is quite cool, and then we have a letter. My name is Adam, and I am 19 years old. I am known as What the Gym on YouTube and Adam James C5 on Instagram. I've been watching your amazing videos since 2019 and have been a subscriber for all of that time. I've also been subscribing to your Jonathan Pushkar channel since the Girl Next Door official music video was uploaded. That song got me through a tough time. I also have listened to your Straighten Up album on Spotify and have compositions on vinyl and on Spotify. I've listened to every song you've released, and my favorite is still The Girl Next Door. However, no one ever said you had to stay as a close second for me. Thank you so much, man. I really appreciate you being into the music here. I am so thankful that your music exists, and it still annoys me that not many people know your music, and they definitely should. Well, if you haven't listened yet, you can do so in the comments. I'll link uh, in the description of this video where you can hear my music. Your Mini Superheroes Today channel is my favorite Lego and Toys channel. I love your hauls, vlogs, set reviews, and mocks, and everything in between. I'm also a big fan of your toy collection, but I want to know, do you have a music collection of sorts for CDs, vinyls, and or other music memorabilia? I know you have some Beach Boys stuff, which is very cool. Yes, I do, actually. Uh, I have all kinds of signed albums from my favorite musicians that I've gotten to meet, as well as lots of vinyl that I've collected over the years and fun stuff. Maybe I'll do a video on that sometime, but for now... Yeah, that's a quick little overview. Both of your channels are some of my favorites, and more people have got to subscribe. It's free for crying out loud. Both of your channels are amazing, and they always make my day even better, which I appreciate. Dude, this letter is amazing. Thank you so much. You are a very inspirational human being to me and to so many other people. You have a great way of saying things and are one of the nicest people I have known on YouTube and Instagram. I want to mention a few of my favorite videos from you now, and they include all of your music videos, the Avengers Mansion and Avengers Compound Mocks, the Graceland videos, super awesome that you went there. I agree, that one was fun. All of your hauls and vlog videos, and four lessons I've learned in my LEGO content creator journey. Thank you so much, man. Hopefully, I will be able to meet you in person and experience what life is like in Tennessee. Thank you for everything, Jonathan, and here's a gift as my appreciation to you. It's the least I can do. From one of your biggest fans, Adam. Oh, and you sent a picture, Adam. That's cool. Very cool. And it says I can show everybody, so I'll show the picture here. Here's Adam visiting Liverpool, England. How cool is that? That's where the Beatles are from. All right, and Adam sent a gift here, so let's see what it is. Oh, man, they're drumsticks. No way. From the Cavern Club in Liverpool. What? <laughs> that is so cool. Ah, Thank you so much, Adam. My band was supposed to play at the Cavern Club in 2020, but of course, well, you guys all know what happened then, so it didn't get to happen, but this is the next best thing. Look at this. I've got drumsticks from where the Beatles got their start. Ah, this is so cool. Thank you so much, Adam. I appreciate that. All right, we've got another letter here, and he sent some figures. We'll take a look at the figures in a second, but the letter says... Dear Jonathan, my name is Xavier and I am your biggest fan and I've been watching your videos now for a long time. Thank you for responding to my comments and wishing me a happy birthday in your Hulk Big Fig video. Well, thank you so much, Xavier. I really appreciate that. And you sent some really cool figures here, too. There's, uh, let's see, it looks like we've got a city figure. We've got Tony Stark with blonde hair. A bunch of random cool stuff, but I'm very appreciative. Thank you for sending me some figures. All right, our next fan mail comes from Brayden. It says, Dear Mini Superheroes Today, I've loved your channel for about a year now. 
The first video I saw was your Zack Snyder's Justice League Showcase, and I've loved your content ever since. Your seventh anniversary video was great. Creating daily content for seven years straight would be super hard. Please keep making quality videos. Thank you from Brayden. Thank you so much, Brayden. I really appreciate that awesome letter. I'm glad that the Justice League video brought you into my channel community here, and uh, I'm glad you're still here. So thank you for writing me. I appreciate it. All right, this next letter comes in from Jacob. It says, Dear Mini Superheroes Today, I'm Jacob and I'm 14. I love watching your videos, especially the Thor Hammer versus Food. It was so funny. That one was really good. <laughs> that was one of the funniest videos I've ever shot. My favorite Lego theme to collect is Marvel, especially Spider-Man, but Harry Potter and Ninjago are cool. I have some cool questions for you. Number one, who is your favorite Spider-Man? Definitely Tobey Maguire, no doubt. Uh, those movies just really meant a lot to me growing up, and they all hit at times when I really needed the messages for those movies, and um, yeah, Tobey's just definitely my favorite Spider-Man. Where do you buy most of your Lego is his next question, and to that I say usually the Lego store, sometimes online, Target, Walmart occasionally. Those are my usual stops. And number three is what is my favorite animal? My favorite animal is the raccoon, not because of Rocket. I just think that they're brilliant animals and uh, they're so fun to watch. And here in Tennessee where I live, raccoons are actually the state animal, which is very cool in the sense that it's our state animal, but it's not cool that it's one of the states that you can't have a raccoon as a pet for that reason. So I'd like to have a pet raccoon, but that means I'm going to have to leave Tennessee and I don't ever want to do that. So you know, never gonna have a pet raccoon. Well, I hope you get this letter safely from Jacob. P.S. Could I have one of your Lego plates? And also, I left a blank sheet of paper so I could sign it. Well, Jacob, I will be happy to sign this for you, and I will be happy to include a mini Superheroes Today brick right here. I'm putting it together now, and I will get that mailed out to you here shortly. Thank you so much. This next letter comes from Brandon. Dear Mini Superheroes Today, I just watched your video and it was really cool that you talked about your experience in YouTube. I watched you for a long time and saw so many cool collections and vlogs you made and I wish I had the money to buy them all. Ha ha ha. Anyways, not much to say, but thank you for all you have done. Keep it up, Brandon. And I got a great little Lego sketch there too. I appreciate it, man. Thank you. And, you know, your joke about having the money to buy all this stuff, uh, you know, obviously Lego is an expensive hobby, but, you know, it doesn't have to be expensive. You can enjoy little sets if that's all you can afford. You can get a million sets if that's what you want. It's really about the creativity and why you build in the first place. So never let money get too much in your head and always stay centered on the fact that it's about the hobby and the fun of the creativity, not who spends the most or who can spend the most. This next letter comes from Luke. Hi, this is Luke. I wrote this letter to tell you that I watched your seventh anniversary of Mini Superheroes Today video on March 19th, 2022. I was also wondering if you will be doing a Kenobi minifig showcase once it comes out. I like your Spider-Man minifig showcases and the Avengers ones. I can't wait for your next videos. Keep up the good work. And Luke put his address in there. Um, yeah, no, I will definitely do a Kenobi showcase here in just a few weeks. Uh, what I do for the Disney Plus shows is the, if the show comes out on a Wednesday, uh, the showcase comes out on the following day. So I think most of the Kenobi episodes do come out on Wednesdays, except for the first episode, which I think comes out on a Friday. But anyways, whenever the episode comes out, the following day is when the showcase will come out. So stay tuned. All right, this next one comes from Daniel. He sent me some Lego pieces here, just some cool stuff. Uh, unfortunately, in shipping, whatever was here came apart. It kind of looks like some Spider-Man mech Doc Ock arms, but... Uh, unfortunately, it did kind of come apart in shipping, so I'm not really sure what he sent, but he did send me a very cool drawing of Spider-Man, so that's really cool, and thank you so much for that, Daniel. Now, this box came from YouTuber Sans. You guys all know Sans. I uh, love him to death. He's hysterical, and he actually sent me this Mega Bloks thing set because he knows I've been reviewing some Mega Bloks here on the channel. Technically, this isn't fan mail because Sans and I talked about it, but I figured I'd give him a shout out here and say hey, and I uh, can't wait to see him again at Brick Fair this summer. 
This next letter comes from Austin, who lives here in the Middle Tennessee area. We've actually met at conventions and stuff a couple times. And look at the cool stickers he put on the back. Spider-Man 3 and Ant-Man, two of my favorite, favorite characters. Oh my gosh, there's all kinds of swag in here. We've got uh, Nashville Sounds stickers, which of course is our local uh, minor league baseball team. So super cool. Oh my gosh, this is going to be a great letter here. What else do we have? Oh, come on, man. I was just saying that we've met at a couple conventions. So here's a picture of us from Brick Fair, Alabama earlier this year. And then ironically, here's a picture from us in December at the Spider-Man No Way Home premiere. That's me as Tobey Maguire Spider-Man. And uh, man, that's so cool. Thank you so much for sending these. But now we've got the letter to read. So let's go ahead and read it. Whoa, it's a front and back. Dear Jonathan, your videos are very inspiring. I love the customs you make and how sincere you are in your videos. Congrats on the recent 50k subs on YouTube. I have been watching since the Endgame Showcase. However, my favorite memory is when I got to see No Way Home in December. When I walked out of the theater already stoked about how good the movie was, I saw three guys dressed up as Peter and thought, what the heck, I'll get my picture with them. And so I did. Flash forward the next day and you posted a video about cosplaying as Spider-Man. I clicked and saw that you and your buds were the ones I got my photo with and you instantly made my day. Flash forward again to Brick Fair, Alabama, and I finally got to meet you without a mask. I don't know if you know this, but Sans helped a ton for helping me meet you. Ironically, we were just talking about Sans. Getting to finally talk to you was crazy. Also, my mom asks if you can tell your editor cameraman hi. So, Jetty, I'm sure you're watching this. Hi from Austin and his mom from Brick Fair, Alabama. Don't you love it how the community just comes together over stuff like this? It's great. Now to another part I don't think you are aware of. After we met you, I went over to one of Bricker builds, and that was the last I saw of you then. Somehow you got in touch with Atlanta Brick Co., you went there and filmed the podcast. The owner says in the interview how nice you are to everyone and goes on to reference you talking to me and my friend at Brick Fair. Once again, look how everything comes full circle. It's amazing. I ended up going with my parents there and told him that he was my, as well as getting one of your custom printed bricks. Thank you, by the way. If you get this letter before ICCC, then I want you to know I will be there and I'm going to wear a Do It shirt when I meet Ian McDiarmid. So ICCC was this past weekend and I've seen you since then, Austin. So uh, once again, full circle yet again. Also, I watched the 50K sub special. You keep being awesome. Well, you've made it to the end of this letter. Thanks for hanging out with me today. Sincerely, Austin, many superheroes, today's number one fan. Well, thank you so much, Austin. That is such a great letter. Look at these great photos. Ah, that's so cool. Thank you, man. All right, that brings us to our final letter, and this one comes from Max and CJ. Dear many superheroes today, Hello there, hope your morning is good. Me and my brother watched your four lessons video. I started a YouTube channel on the 14th of March and watching those four lessons are starting to help me when I post and what I make. But my brother, he started his channel back in 2020 but was posting a year after each video and when he saw your four lessons video, he said to me that he will start again this week. We both want to thank you for the content you post. If you want to check out my YouTube channel, it's Macaroni and Maxaroni and Cheese. Sincerely, Max and CJ. Well, thank you so much for that great letter, and I'm so glad to know that my video talking about my journey is helping to inspire you to get started on your journey. All right, so I mentioned that everybody that sent in fan mail for this would get a surprise. So there's two surprises. One is a little more for me and the other is a little more for you. I'll start with the one for me just to get it out of the way. I keep a binder of all the fan mail that I've ever been sent and it's all right here. So very, very cool. And everybody that I just read will get added to the binder. So that's very awesome. And uh, I'm excited to do that. All right, now the offer for you guys. Those of you that wrote in here, 
I am doing a print. I don't want to tell you what it is because it's a surprise, but I'm going to sign it and send it to you since I have your mailing addresses here from the return address on the envelope. So keep an eye out in the mail here in the next uh, couple weeks here and I'll get it out to you. It'll be sooner than that, but I just want to be safe just in case the mail takes a long time or whatever. But anyways, thank you guys so much. If you want to see your letter read on a fan mail video, you can send it in as soon as you see this one. Uh, you know, I kind of wait until I get enough to justify making a video, and this time there sure was a lot to make. So thank you guys so much for the support here on the channel. Um, you know, all these words were just so amazing. I'm just speechless at how uh, grateful I am that you guys have been a part of this channel, continue to be a part, are so supportive, and took the time to write me celebrating my seven-year anniversary. So thank you guys so much. Be sure to continue building, guys. Don't ever let that creative spark go out. It's a tough world we live in, but, you know, Lego and the creativity that comes with it is an awesome light that we get to shine and put our thumbprint into what we do. So stay inspired out there, guys. Thank you so much for following along here on the channel. Uh, much love to everybody watching this, and I will catch you guys next time. Well, you made it to the end of the video. Thanks for hanging out with me today, and don't forget to hit like and subscribe, and maybe check out one of my other videos listed here.